You're watching the Northeastern News Program that keeps you up to date, aware, and informed on all things related to Northeastern High School. This is High Street Morning News. Good morning, Northeastern. Today is Wednesday, October 18th, 2017, Cycle Day 3. I'm Morgan Reynolds. And I'm Emma Sadowski. Let's get right to those announcements. Today, your college will be here at 9, which is right after the show. Tomorrow, the Army will be here at 9.15, and a representative from Stevenson will arrive at 10.30. Sign up or just stop by if you would like to meet up with any of these schools. Are you looking for answers about the Christian religion? The Gap is hosting a rally day this Sunday, October 22nd. Students, a panel of pastors. I'm just going to wait a second. Lobby. All right. A panel of pastors and church leaders will be there to answer your unanswered questions. The Gap is at 22 South Main Street in Mount Wolf. The First Priority Club here at our school is inviting you to this event, so if you're interested, feel free to attend. Just Another Snow Day is the underclassmen play featuring 16 students from grades 9 and 10. This is a hilarious collection of scenes about an unexpected day off from school. Join us on October 21st and 22nd at 7 o'clock p.m. in the Sutton Auditorium for what promises to be a fun-filled evening of live theater at its best. Tickets are $5 for students and senior citizens are 7 for adults are available for cast members at the door. See you at the show. There will be a past meeting on October 23rd for all past members during academic prep in room 708. During this time, you will be getting your picture taken for the yearbook. If you have any questions, see Ms. Bizignani. The junior class will be selling Auntie Anne's pretzels and Kool-Aid after school on Friday, October 27th. The pretzels cost $2.50 and the Kool-Aid costs $1.00. And a pretzel Kool-Aid combo costs $3.00. All proceeds go to this year's junior class senior prom. Students and staff members, would you like to honor a veteran in your life? If so, bring a photo of your veteran so it can be included in our annual Veterans Day Assembly and our live video production. Photos should be given to Mr. Swartz in room 307 before Friday, November 3rd. Be sure to include the veteran's name, branch of service, date of service, and relationship to you. Photos are limited to one submission per student, and they will be returned as quickly as possible. Even though the cold weather is not here yet, it is never too early to start thinking about the upcoming weather, winter, especially if you like to ski or snowboard. Consider joining the Bobcat Ski Club this year to get a discounted club card for the upcoming season. Options include lift tickets, rentals, and lessons. If you are new to the sport and want to try it out, then use a Try and You'll Like It coupon at a low group rate of $61. This includes a lift ticket, rentals, and a lesson. See Ms. Gaynor in room 415 for more information. Online purchases are quick, easy, and need to be in by November 6th to get the early bird rate. The Fall Sports Awards Ceremony will be held on Wednesday, November 8th at 7 p.m. in the High School Auditorium. All JV and varsity student athletes, families, and friends are invited. Student athletes will receive an, uh, all awards, including certificates, letters, pins, and plaques. Student athletes must be present to receive their awards. If you have any questions, please contact the athletic office. On Tuesday, November 14th, Varsity Club is planning a college visit to the University of Pittsburgh. Up to 40 students can attend this trip. If you're interested, see Mr. McCollum or Ms. Nyman in room 403 for a permission slip. The cost of the trip is $25 for, the var for Varsity Club members and $30 for all other students. Today we are going to take it down to Fatu with some girls from the Varsity Girls soccer team. So what's up guys? Thanks, guys. I'm down. I'm down here with Brittany and Gabby. They're going to be telling us about a game that's going on this evening. So, what's happening? Um, tonight we're playing in the county championship at Bermudian Springs at 7:30 against Central York. This is the first time we've been in the county championship for a couple of years, and we're really excited. And how have the last couple of games been going? Um, well, we've been in overtime most of them. Um, they've mostly been double overtime, so it's been really um, scary and nerve-wracking. But it's okay. Do you guys think you have enough momentum to win this game tonight? I definitely think we do. We're really hype and excited for it. Um, we're going in really confident, and we just have to do our best. And what kind of history would this make for the program? Um, this will be our first time winning county finals if we win tonight. We've only been in the finals one other time before, so it's pretty big for us. Alrighty, and what is motivate motivating you guys to play so well? 
Well, eight of our varsity team is all seniors, so it's been our goal since freshman year, and it would mean a lot to us, and that's what's pushing us. And then also, as everybody knows, the season's for Abby, so we're just trying to make her proud. Alrighty, good luck tonight. Make sure you come out and support. If you can, let's take it back to the desk. Thanks, guys. Let's send it over to sports. Good morning, Northeastern. The girls said in the interview the girls' soccer team is playing in the county final game tonight. The team will be playing Central at Bermudian Springs Field at 7.30. I know it's a hike, but this game is definitely worth coming out for. Good luck to the girls' soccer team in your championship game. If you're staying in town tonight, stop by the high school at 7 p.m. for the girls' volleyball last home game. The team plays at 7, but the girls' senior night will be held beforehand. L good luck. Make this last game your best one. Now for lunch. Today's lunch will be having homemade stromboli with marinara sauce, and the sandwich of the day is pub burger with fixins. For tomorrow's breakfast, we'll be having mini sinis, and tomorrow's lunch will be chicken tenders with pasta alfredo, and the sandwich of the day is fish and cheese. Now let's take it on over the weather. Okay, today it's 41 degrees and sunny. And uh, the humidity is 97% with a wind mile, mile, mileage of 2 miles per hour. And let's take it to the 5 day. Okay, towards the end of the week, we have a good 70 degrees with a low of 49. And uh, yeah, so it should be a good weather for Sunday football. And uh, yeah, might need a jacket. Let's take it back to the desk. All right, that's all we have for today. Have a great day, Northeastern. And stay classy.